Good evening, all you folks at New Music Review. Let's uh, see what we got today. If you like what we're doing, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, all that sort of stuff. It all helps to get a bit more, a bit more progress through the YouTube algorithms and all that stuff. Um, we're looking at Frank Schilbach and the track Brown Eyes, and I think the band is Port Nazim, or he's going under the name of that anyway. Uh, Frank's quite active on the on the Facebook groups. Artist Support Network, I think is where this one came from. So check that out as well. Let's play the song. I've got the guitar here today just to see if we work out the chords quickly as well, see what's going on. Okay, here we go. She had like some metal since Rana. And she came Tuesday. And she came Tuesday. And left me Friday night. Hi Mina. She ran a lecture from my brain. Okay, so we've got an A minor, C minor, C, G. And that that uh, that doesn't change to the F sharp. Cool. Let's just see it and a change to an um, electric guitar as well. Okay, it's a nice change. Yes, the F sharp, the F sharp, uh, the F suspended. Nice chord. Let's go back a bit now. Just have a listen. What's going on? Okay, so we've got two acoustic guitars panned left and right by the sounds of it. Um, we've got a nice sounding drum kit going on. The vocal sits quite nice. Um, po possibly might have mixed the vocals a little brighter, but you know, sounds good. She took my mind out and ripped my soul out and left me Friday night. Um, it's a bit of organ in the background. Uh, that electric's a little bit out of sorts. It kind of sort of works and m maybe doesn't work. I'm not sure. It's a bit odd, but, you know, it adds to the um, dynamics of the track and it's um, it's quite up in the mix. Yeah, but, you know, it's fine. I like that chord. Keys in the background. Acoustic guitars have gone. I think. Yeah, nice idea to drop the acoustics while the the little solo is going on there, and just have the bass, um, electric, and the drums, um, and the and so on. Sounds quite cool. And the would have been nice to have heard a little bit of tremolo or something like that, or some weird tremolo -y reverb on that guitar, give it a real, real, um, twang. Vocals, nice. I like the the pitch change there, the sort of key, you know, the uh, the octaves change almost. But it's a little lost in the mix just here. Nice 
nice mixer. Cool, I like it. Uh, I like it, guys. It's um, it's got a good rhythm. It's got a good, good quality recording. It seems like. Don't know if you did it at home, if you've had it done in a studio or mastered it. Looks like it's had some mastering effect on it by the look of the uh, look of the waveform. But yeah, nice um, simple chords. Throws in that um, that F suspended thing there, which is nice chord. Um, nice guitar sounds. Vocals. You know, lots of people don't tend to put so many harmonies in on a lot of the stuff that's around just now on the demos and i'm not sure if that's because they're not confident with them or or what so uh, I, I always like the um vocals to be a bit bigger a bit left and right add bits and pieces to them and get the harmonies in there get the get the backing vocals in there and make them all a bit bigger and just nicer sounding especially on the back end of the song and uh getting some something memorable you know the, the big vocal chorusy sound so as people go away listening or hearing uh the end result so anyway guys frank and whoever's in that band thanks for uh, submitting the track and i hope you're doing uh, doing okay and uh, look forward to hearing some other more of your stuff in the future thanks for submitting but